Hello everyone, this is Mamta Mund and today we will learn and solve exercise 11b questions 1 to 12 of chapter 11. Chapter name is Understanding Elementary Shapes of Class 6 of Composite Mathematics Textbook. Let's get started and solve some questions. Today we will learn and solve exercise 11b questions 1 to 12 of chapter 11. Chapter name is understanding elementary shapes and topics are protractor and topic and types of angles. Let's solve some questions. Now we will solve question number 4. State the kind of angles in each case formed between the following direction. First bit is east and west. This is north, east, south, west, east and west. This is east, from east to west. This is 180 degrees. So this is a straight angle. So the angle formed between the east between the direction east and west is straight angle. Now question number four, four second bit. State the kind of angles formed between the following direction east and north. This is north, east, west, south. The angle formed between east and north. This is east and this is north. This is 90 degree. So this is a right angle. So the angle formed between the direction east and north is right angle. Now question number third bit. Four third bit. State the kind of angles formed between the direction north and northeast. This is north, east, south, west. North and northeast. And this is north east. So the angle formed between north, this is north and north east this is acute angle this is more than 0 degree but less than 90 degree this is acute angle so the angle formed between north and northeast direction is acute angle Now question number 4th bit. State the kind of angles formed between the direction north and southeast. This is north, east, south, west. This is north and southeast is different. From north to east is 90 degree and east to southeast is 45 degree. So 90 plus 45 is 135 degree which is more than 90 degree but less than 180 degree. So this is an obtuse angle. So the angle formed between north, the direction north and south east north and south east North and South East is obtuse angle. Now we will solve question number 5. What is the size of the reflex angle between the hands of the clock at 3 o'clock, 5 o'clock and 8 o'clock? First draw the figure of a clock. This is 12, 1, 2, 3, 
four, five, six, seven, eight, this is nine, ten, and eleven. So three o'clock. This is three o'clock, and this is ninety degree. So the reflex angle. This is reflex angle of ninety degree. So the reflex angle between the hands of the clock at three o'clock is. 390 degree minus 90 degree. 360 degree minus 90 degree is 270 degree. So the reflex angle. So the reflex angle between the hands of the clock at three o'clock is 270 degree. Now five o'clock. This is five o'clock. And this angle is this is ninety degree, and this is forty five degree. Ninety plus forty five is one hundred thirty five. More than one hundred thirty five degree. Okay. This is one hundred fifty degree. Five o'clock. This is 150 degree. This is 90, and this is 60 degree. So this is 50 degree. The complete whole circle is 360 degree, and there are 12 rotation, 12 number. So each angle is 30 degree. So the angle between 12 to 1 is 30 degree. 1 to 2 is 30 degree. 2 to 3 is 30 degree. So angle between 3 to 12 is 90 degree. So the angle between 3 to 4 is 30 degree and 4 to 5 is 30 degree. So total angle at 5 o'clock is 3 plus 3, 30 plus 30 plus 30 plus 30 plus 30, 530. That is 5 multiplied by 30 degree is 150 degree. So the angle, this angle is 150 degree. So the reflex angle, this is reflex angle. Reflex angle between the hands of the clock at 5 o'clock will be the total complete circle is 360 degree. And this angle is 150 degree. So this is 210 degree. So the reflex angle between the hands of the clock is clock at five o'clock is two hundred ten degree. This is two hundred ten. This is reflex angle. So the size of the reflex angle between the hands of the clock at five o'clock is two hundred ten degree. Now the size of the reflex angle between the hands of the clock. At eight o'clock, this is twelve. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Eight o'clock. This is eight o'clock. So the reflex angle between the hands of the clock at eight o'clock is this. Each angle is thirty degree. From twelve to one is thirty. One to two is thirty degree. So three multiplied thirty degree multiplied with eight. That is two hundred forty degree. This is two hundred forty degree. So the reflex angle between the hands of the clock at eight o'clock is two hundred forty degrees.
if you have not subscribed my youtube channel then please subscribe my youtube channel and if you have any doubt then please write in comment section and i will reply keep learning keep watching and please subscribe my youtube channel thank you, thank you.